Daily Devotionals for May 15th. Today's scripture reading will be Exodus 20, verse 12. Honor your father and your mother, that your days may be long upon the land which the Lord your God is giving you. Now, of course, this is uh, one of the Ten Commandments, and it's the one that has a promise. We are to honor our parents, and then the blessing is we have basically long life. We have reward. How do we honor our parents? You know, not all parents are loving and kind. And think if you're a child, you will probably be a parent. <laughs> and if you're a parent, obviously you've been a child. Sometimes our parents can be difficult, but then children can be difficult too. Maybe that's why parents are <laughs> cranky. But sometimes... It's difficult to uh, agree with your parents, but it that does not matter. We need to always give honor to our parents. Even if we disagree with them, we need to number one, obey our parents and love our parents and honor them. Even at, you know what is, kids it's not so difficult but as they grow up, teenagers and then young adults, and even in adulthood, we disagree. We disagree with one another and especially our parents because we're of different age groups, different era. So we're not gonna see things the same. But, you know, Jesus, he honored his father. Think about it. He was with the father at creation. He knew all the glory, all the essence of heaven. And then he honored his father by coming to this earth, knowing that they were going to mock and, and ridicule and, and scourge him and crucify him. Yet he honored his father by coming to give his life for us. So can we not do the same in just honoring our parents? You know, we if we begin honoring our parents, like I said, especially in adulthood, you probably disagree with your parents because they aren't, they're trying to raise you the old fashioned way and you're still trying to do things your way. But you know, if you can serve the Lord first, that's the greatest way. Honor God first. And in honoring God, you're gonna honor your parents because if you serve the Lord, you're gonna serve him with a heart of love. And out of that heart of love, everything else will flow. And part of the way that you can uh, honor your parents many times is by keeping this thing shut. You know, you, the greatest thing sometimes you can do is just keep quiet because if you open your mouth and speak something, it would be unkind and, you know, just keep quiet and you'll, you will really bless yourself and you'll bless your parents. You know, uh, None, none of us are a mistake. <clears throat> God planned each and every one of our lives and he chose the parents to birth us, okay? Even if some of us were adopted or, you know, whatever. He chose those parents. Some children, you know, they're adopted. They never even knew their, their uh, birth parents or maybe one of them. But you know what? God chose those people to come together to create in him you. And we need to, without any second thought, honor our parents. And our reward is just because he honors us when we honor them. Okay, till next time, be blessed.